Hey everyone! Welcome back to the channel, where we uncover hidden treasures in the world of coin collecting. Today, we're talking about something so small, yet incredibly valuable. Lincoln once sent pennies that are worth millions. That's right, some pennies in your pocket might just be worth a fortune. Whether you're a coin collector, or someone who's just curious about rare finds, you'll want to stick around. We're counting down the top 20 most valuable Lincoln pennies ever sold. So let's dive right in. Today, we're diving into an amazing topic, the 1977 D. Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. You may have heard rumors of this little coin being worth up to a million dollars, and today we're going to explore why. But first, let me break it down. We'll be covering the history of the coin, why certain variations of it have become highly sought after, and finally, the current market value that's making headlines. Stick around until the end because I'll also be talking about how to check if your 1977 penny could be one of those rare, high-value finds. So, without further ado, let's get started. 1. The history of the Lincoln penny Before we get into the specifics of the 1977 D penny, we need to talk about the Lincoln penny itself. Introduced in 1909, the Lincoln cent was created to commemorate the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. This iconic design, featuring Lincoln's profile on the obverse, front, has become a mainstay in American coinage ever since. The coin was the first U.S. coin to feature a president's portrait, a big deal back in the day. The reverse, back, design originally had wheat stalks, giving it the nickname, Wheat Penny. However, in 1959, to mark the 150th anniversary of Lincoln's birth, the wheat stalks were replaced with the Lincoln Memorial which is the design you'll find on the 1977 pennies.so what about the D mint mark? This indicates that the penny was minted in Denver. Coins with mint marks are significant because each U.S. mint, Philadelphia, Denver, San Francisco, and occasionally West Point, has its own production practices, errors, and rarities, all of which can affect a coin's value. Why the 1977 D penny is special now, here's where things get really interesting. You might be wondering, why is the 1977 D penny worth a lot of money? Well, not all of them are, but some specific versions of this coin have become extremely valuable. There are a few key reasons for this. First, condition. In coin collecting, condition is everything. Coins that are in mint state, meaning they have no wear, scratches, or damage, are always more valuable. Grading agencies like PCGS and NGC rate coins on a scale from 1 to 70, and if a 1977 D penny is found in MS67 or higher, it's considered extremely rare. Point one perfect example is a MS67 plus graded 1977 D penny that sold at auction for $2,880. Now, while this isn't exactly a million dollars, it's still way more than one cent. But what's turning heads in the numismatic world are the high-quality specimens or those with unusual errors that collectors go crazy for. What makes this penny worth a million dollars? So, how do we go from a few thousand dollars to that magic million-dollar figure? It all comes down to coin errors and rarity. Point one type of error is the double die error, where a coin's image appears to be doubled because of a mistake in the minting process. A double die error on a 1977 D penny could significantly boost its value, especially if it's in pristine condition. Another key factor is off-center strikes or broad strikes, where the design of the coin is misaligned. These errors make each coin unique, and collectors love uniqueness. Now, while there's no confirmed sale of a 1977 D penny for exactly a million dollars yet, there's a belief that the right combination of rarity, error, and grade could push the value of one to the million dollar mark or more in a future auction. As we all know, the value of rare coins can skyrocket with demand. Now, I'm sure you're wondering. Do I have one of these valuable 1977 D pennies? Here's how you can check. 1. Look for mint errors. Examine your penny for any signs of doubling, off-center strikes, or any other errors. Even the tiniest flaw could make it rare. Point 2. Condition is key. If your coin has been in circulation for decades, it might show signs of wear, which will lower its value. However, if it looks like it just rolled off the mint, it could be worth much more. Point three. Get it graded. 
If you think you've found a pristine or era 1977 D penny, the best thing to do is have it graded by a professional service like PCGS or NGC. A high grade could boost its value dramatically. Right now, 1977 D pennies in good condition are typically worth about $1 to $5. However, those in mint state, especially graded ones, can go for anywhere between $500 to several thousand dollars. If you're lucky enough to have one with a major error or in near perfect condition, you could be looking at an auction price that blows past those figures. And who knows? If the right buyer comes along, the million dollar sale could be just around the corner. So, there you have it. The 1977D penny might just be another penny to most people, but to a coin collector, it could be a hidden treasure worth thousands or even millions of dollars. The key is in the details. Whether it's an error, its condition, or its rarity. Do you think you might have a valuable 1977D penny in your collection? Let me know in the comments below. And of course, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on more exciting content about rare coins and treasures. Thanks for watching, and as always, happy hunting! Hey everyone! Welcome back to the channel where we explore rare and valuable coins that you could have hiding in your pocket change. Today, we're diving deep into one of the most fascinating and talked about coins in recent history the 1981 No Mint Mark Lincoln cent, a penny that could potentially be worth over $1.3 million. That's right, one tiny penny could make you a millionaire. How crazy is that? But how did this seemingly ordinary coin become so valuable? What makes it special, and could you have one lying around? Let's jump into the history, the key details, and the current market value of this rare penny, the Lincoln penny, also known as the Lincoln cent, was first introduced in 1909 to commemorate the 100th anniversary of President Abraham Lincoln's birth. It was the first U.S. coin to feature a real person, and it replaced the Indian head cent, which had been in circulation since 1859. The coin's obverse design, featuring Lincoln's profile, was created by sculptor Victor D. Brenner asterisk asterisk, and it has been a staple in U.S. currency ever since. By the time the 1980s rolled around, pennies were still a major part of everyday transactions. But something happened in 1981 that has since created one of the most valuable and rarest varieties of this coin. Typically, when coins are minted in the United States, they carry a mint mark to indicate where they were produced. These mint marks are tiny letters located just below the date on the penny. Here's a quick refresher for you tongue sticking out for the Philadelphia Mint D for the Denver Mints for the San Francisco Mint but here's the catch. In 1981, a batch of Lincoln pennies were struck without any mint mark. Now, this wasn't the first time a penny had been produced without a mint mark, but for the 1981 penny, this anomaly has made it incredibly desirable among coin collectors. Some theories suggest that the omission may have been due to a production oversight or equipment malfunction at the Philadelphia Mint.so. Why is this important? Now, let's talk value because this is the real reason you're here, right? As we all know, collectors love unique coins, and errors or anomalies like this can send values skyrocketing. This no mint mark penny has something that other pennies from the same year don't, rarity and mystery. No one knows exactly how many of these coins were made, and that uncertainty drives up the value dramatically. Plus, the penny itself is from 1981, the last year the U.S. Mint used 95% copper in the production of pennies before switching to a copper-plated zinc composition in 1982. That makes the 1981 penny part of the final batch of high copper content pennies, adding another layer of appeal to collectors. But here's where things get really wild. A pristine, High grade 1981 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny was recently estimated to be worth an astonishing $1.3 million. That's right, $1.3 million for a single penny. This coin has set auction records, and its value continues to climb as more collectors get wind of its rarity. This isn't just pocket change, this is life changing money. So, how can you tell if you've got one of these golden tickets in your change jar? Here's what you need to look for. No mint mark asterisk asterisk below the year. 1981. On the front of the coin. The coin should be in excellent condition, preferably with minimal wear and tear. 
The highest values are reserved for pennies that are graded MS 65 or higher on the coin grading scale. Coins in pristine condition, with sharp details and a lustrous finish, can fetch top dollar. Even if your coin isn't in perfect condition, it could still be worth a pretty penny. Pun intended, if you think you have one of these coins, it's essential to get it professionally graded by a coin grading service like PCGS or NGC. Having a certified grade can make a huge difference in determining its true value at auction. The million-dollar question, literally, is how much this coin is worth right now. As of today, the highest recorded sale for a 1981 no-mint Mark Lincoln cent in mint condition was $1.3 million. However, most coins in slightly lower grades still sell for impressive sums, often in the tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands, depending on their condition. Prices can vary widely, so if you're lucky enough to have one of these in your collection, you could be sitting on a small fortune. So, could you have a 1981 no mint Mark Lincoln penny sitting somewhere in your loose change? The odds are slim, but stranger things have happened. Remember, coin collecting is all about patience, knowledge, and a little bit of luck. Who knows, that next penny you check might just be the one that changes your life. If you found this video helpful, or if you're excited to go check your change jar, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more coin collecting tips, and leave a comment below. Have you ever come across a rare penny? Let me know, and as always, happy collecting! Until next time, thanks for watching! Don't forget to hit the bell icon so you never miss an update on rare coins and collectibles. See you in the next video! Welcome to our channel! your go-to source for all things related to coin collecting. Today, we have something special to talk about, the 2017 P. Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny. This coin has an interesting history, some rare qualities, and its current market value is surprising, reaching up to $8,299. Let's dive deep into why this coin is so valuable, how it came to be, and what you should look for if you're lucky enough to have one in your possession. Asterisk let's start with a bit of history behind this coin. Most of us are familiar with the Lincoln cent, also known as the Lincoln penny, which has been in circulation since 1909. Abraham Lincoln was the first historical figure to appear on a circulating American coin. However, the 2017 Lincoln cent carries a unique distinction that makes it stand out from its peers, and that's the P. Mint Mark. Here's where things get interesting. Prior to 2017, Philadelphia minted pennies did not bear a mint mark. Coins minted in Denver had the D mint mark, while those minted in San Francisco had an S mint mark. Philadelphia minted coins were left without any mint mark until 2017. So, why the change in 2017? 2017 marked the 225th anniversary of the United States Mint. To celebrate this milestone, the U.S. Mint decided to add the P. Mint Mark to pennies minted in Philadelphia for the first time in history. This special mark was a one-time event and is not expected to appear on any future pennies. The addition of the Mint Mark made this penny particularly interesting to collectors, especially since it breaks with over two centuries of tradition. While the 2017 penny may seem like any other copper-plated zinc cent, the P. Mint Mark makes it rare and highly collectible. This change was somewhat subtle, and many people didn't notice it at first, leading to fewer pennies being set aside by collectors when they were first released. Historical significance asterisk asterisk. This is the only year Philadelphia minted pennies carry the P. Mint Mark, making it a standout coin in Lincoln cent history. Collector demand asterisk asterisk. Because it was a one-year event. Collectors are keen to own a piece of this unique milestone in U.S. Mint history condition asterisk asterisk, as always in the world of coin. Collecting condition matters. Uncirculated coins or coins in mint condition, MS 67 or higher, are much more valuable than those showing signs of wear and tear. But how much are we really talking about? Well, this brings us to the current market value of the 2017 P. Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. Now, Here's where things get exciting. You might be wondering, how could a penny from 2017 possibly be worth thousands of dollars? Well, let me break it down for you. Most 2017 P. Mint Mark Lincoln cents found in everyday circulation won't be worth more than face value, 
just one cent. However, certain coins, especially those in extremely high grades and mint condition, have fetched astonishing prices at auctions. Coins graded at MS67 or MS68 can bring in significantly higher prices because of their near-flawless appearance and the rarity of finding a 2017 penny in such pristine condition. I in fact, one coin, graded MS67 plus RD, sold at auction for an impressive dollar eight, two ninety nine. Yes, that's right. One penny sold for thousands of dollars. Why such a high price? Low population asterisk asterisk. Very few 2017 P mint mark pennies have been found in such perfect condition, making them highly desirable to collectors. Grading asterisk asterisk. As mentioned earlier, professional grading services like PCGS or NGC give coins grades based on their condition. The higher the grade, the more valuable the coin. An MS67 plus penny is extremely rare. Collector sentiment asterisk asterisk. For many, this coin represents a piece of U.S. Mint history, and collectors are willing to pay a premium for that. So, how can you tell if your 2017 P. Mint Mark penny is worth a fortune? Here are a few steps. 1. Check the Mint Mark asterisk asterisk. The first thing to look for is the P. Mint Mark, located just below the date on the front of the penny. Without this Mint Mark, the coin is just a regular 2017 penny. 2. Examine the condition asterisk asterisk. Look closely at the coin's condition. Is it free of scratches, dents, or discoloration? The more flawless it looks, the better chance it has of being valuable. Point three. Get the coin graded asterisk asterisk. If you think you have a coin in exceptional condition, consider sending it to a professional grading service like PCGS or NGC. This will give you an official grade and help you determine its market value. Point four. Consult with experts asterisk asterisk. If you're unsure, take the coin to a reputable coin dealer or numismatist who can give you a better idea of its worth. As we move forward, the 2017 P Mint Mark Lincoln cent is likely to become more sought after, especially as more collectors recognize its historical significance. Right now, it's already considered a modern rarity, but over time, its value could continue to increase. If you're a collector, Holding on to these pennies might be a smart investment, particularly if they are in uncirculated condition or graded at a high level. Who knows? Maybe your penny could be the next one to fetch a staggering amount at auction. In conclusion, the 2017 P. Mint Mark Lincoln One Cent Penny is a fascinating piece of U.S. coin history. Its unique features, one-time mint mark, and increasing demand from collectors have made it a highly sought-after coin. While most are still worth just a penny, those rare finds in pristine condition can be worth thousands, up to $8, $2.99 in some cases. If you've enjoyed this deep dive into the world of coin collecting, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with fellow collectors, and subscribe for more content like this. Let me know in the comments if you've come across any 2017 P. Mint Mark pennies or if you have any questions about other rare coins. Happy collecting! And until next time, keep hunting for those treasures. Thanks for watching. Asterisk. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into something really interesting. Asterisk asterisk the 2021 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny asterisk asterisk. Believe it or not, some of these coins are being sold for up to $3,299. How did this happen? Is your penny worth a small fortune? Let's break down the history, the value, and what makes these coins so special. First, let's talk history. The Lincoln penny has been a staple of American currency since 1909, when it was introduced to celebrate the centennial of Abraham Lincoln's birth. It was the first time a U.S. coin had featured a president's likeness, a big deal back in the day. Over the years, the design has seen several changes, most notably the reverse side which initially featured wheat stalks, then the Lincoln Memorial, and now the Union Shield design starting from 2010. But today, we're zeroing in on the 2021 No Mint Mark Penny, a coin that's turning heads in the collector's market. So, what does No Mint Mark mean? When you see a penny with No Mint Mark, it's actually from the Philadelphia Mint. The Philadelphia Mint doesn't always use a mint mark for pennies, which is why you won't see one on most coins made there. 
This is different from coins minted in Denver D or San Francisco S, where mint marks are always present. Now, pennies from Philadelphia aren't particularly rare because they produce billions of coins each year. So why are these 2021 no mint mark pennies suddenly fetching such high prices? It's all about errors and high grades. Let's get into why some 2021 pennies are worth up to dollar three, two ninety nine. There are a few key factors at play here. One, high grade condition. Coins graded by professional grading services like PCGS or NGC are valued based on their condition. Coins that score MS 68 or higher, mint state, are virtually flawless and can command high prices at auction. Many 2021 pennies being sold for thousands are in this near perfect condition. Point two. Error coins. Another factor is error coins. Sometimes during the minting process, mistakes happen, like a missed strike, die break, or doubling of the image. These errors are rare and highly sought after by collectors. Some 2021 pennies with unusual errors have been sold for a premium. Point three. Market hype. Lastly, the market is often driven by hype. When collectors realize a certain year or error is scarce, prices can skyrocket. And in today's world of online auctions, it only takes a few high bids to push the value way up. Now you're probably wondering, do I have a valuable 2021 penny? Well, here's how to find out. 1. Examine the condition. First, look at the condition of your penny. Does it have any scratches or wear? If not, it could be worth having it graded professionally. Point two. Look for errors. Use a magnifying glass to check for any visible errors, like doubling on Lincoln's face, unusual markings, or flaws on the Union Shield. Point three. Get it graded. If you think your penny is in pristine condition or has an error, it might be worth getting it graded by PCGS or NGC. These services can authenticate your coin and assign a grade, which significantly impacts its value. As of now, some 2021 no mint mark Lincoln pennies have sold for as much as $3,299, particularly those graded MS 68 or higher. But keep in mind, these are exceptional cases. Most pennies from 2021 are only worth face value unless they are in mint condition or have unique errors. The current market is a bit of a roller coaster, with prices fluctuating depending on demand, condition, and the number of error coins found. On average, a high-grade 2021 penny might sell for around $100-$300, but rare coins can reach the thousands. So, should you sell your 2021 pennies now, or hold on to them? If you have a high-grade or error coin, it could be a good idea to list it while prices are high. However, coin markets can be unpredictable, and holding on to a rare coin might pay off even more in the long run. If you're a collector, you know the thrill of waiting to see if your coin appreciates over time. But if you need a quick sale, now is a great time to take advantage of the market hype. In conclusion, while most 2021 20, pennies aren't worth more than a penny, some are fetching thousands due to their perfect condition or rare errors. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just checking the change in your pocket, it's always exciting to see if you've got something special. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our future coin videos. Who knows, maybe the next penny you find could be worth a fortune.